Hey guys, Kindle Fire Gnome here, and the day has finally come. I have rooted my Kindle Fire. Now today in this video, I'll be going over my top apps for the rooted Kindle Fire. Alright, let's get started. So I'm going to unlock my Kindle Fire. The first thing you're going to want to do is go into Play Store and search Volume Control. You want to want to get this one by Rubber Big Pepper. And focus... By rubber big pepper. Download that. Get prompted to this download screen. After you've downloaded it, go into your app drawer, find it, and this is what you're going to get prompted with. You can adjust the transparency, you can adjust the size of it here. What this really is, guys, is if you're in any app, everybody knows that the Kindle Fire doesn't have a volume rocker. There's only one physical button on the device, and when you root your Kindle, you take away the virtual button. And there's only one way to really change the volume is right here. You can really just go through presets, or you're going to have to all go all the way into settings, uh, sound settings, volume, and you have to change it all from there. Well, some people might not mind doing that. I found an easier solution. So the what volume control allows you to do it allows you to slide your finger up and down the right side to display the volume. So now I'm at 66% volume. So I'm gonna I'll show you guys how this works. Let me go on my music. Mm. Play a little Weezer for you guys. This volume now. So now you can't hear me, but if watch as I scroll up. You can fully hear Weezer playing. Alright, now the next app I'm gonna show you guys is actually pretty simple. It's just the YouTube app. Everybody's seen the Android YouTube app. And I gone over in another video how to get it on an unrooted Kindle Fire. But this one all you have to do go in the Play Store. Search YouTube. And then there you go. You know, that's YouTube. And now, a lot of you guys probably don't think this is a big deal. It's really not a big deal. But there is no dedicated YouTube app on the Kindle Fire. And there's no YouTube app available in the App Store. In the uh, Amazon App Store. So, I like this app. I watch a lot of YouTube videos. And I find it pretty useful and it runs very smoothly on the Kindle. So you're just going to go to the download screen, click install, come back out, app drawer, YouTube, and boom, you got a YouTube player right there. I'll show you guys YouTube playback, show you how smooth it is, show you one of my latest videos I posted. You guys can check it out. Uh, Hope Post Trap Review for iOS. And you can't use Volume Control Plus right here. Oh yeah, you can. Oh sweet. All right. Well, you can see it runs fairly smoothly. And it's a very nice app. All right, guys. Well, that is my top apps as of today for my Rudy Kindle Fire. I'm sure I'll find more eventually as I get to play around on it a little bit more. But yeah, guys, if you guys got any comments or questions, just leave them down in the comment section, and I'll be sure to get to them. All right, guys, thanks for watching.